Good evening, everyone. Such a pleasure to be with you as we continue on day four of our uh, Holy Spirit Novena. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful, and enkindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. O God, who by the light of the Holy Spirit did instruct the hearts of your faithful, grant that by that same Holy Spirit we may always be truly wise and ever rejoice in his consolation. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. We pray for the gifts of the Spirit. Loving God, renew in our hearts the sevenfold gifts of your Spirit, wisdom, knowledge, and reverence, right judgment and courage, wonder and awe, that our lives might bear an abundant harvest of the fruits of your Spirit, love, joy, faithfulness, and trust, patience, gentleness, and kindness, modesty, chastity, and self-control, goodness, and peace. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Today we pray for the virtue of patience. Litany to the Holy Spirit. Lord, have mercy on us. God, the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God, the Holy Spirit, Redeemer of the world. God, the Holy Spirit, Holy Trinity, one God. Divine Essence, one true God, have mercy on us. Spirit of truth and wisdom, have mercy on us. Spirit of holiness and justice. Spirit of understanding and counsel. Spirit of love and joy. Spirit of peace and patience. Spirit of longanimity and meekness, Spirit of the benignity and goodness, Love substantial of the Father and the Son, have mercy on us, Love and life of saintly souls, have mercy on us, Fire ever burning, Living water to quench the thirst of hearts, From all evil, deliver us, O Holy Spirit, From all impurity and soul of body, deliver us, O Holy Spirit, from all gluttony and sensuality, deliver us, O Holy Spirit. From all attachments to the things of this earth, from all hypocrisy and pretense, from all imperfections and deliberate faults, from our own will, from slander, from deceiving our neighbors, from our passions and disorderly appetites, deliver us, O Holy Spirit from wishing to seek or desire anything other than thee deliver us o holy spirit from everything that displeases thee most loving father forgive us divine word have pity on us holy and divine spirit leave us not until we are in possession of the divine essence heaven of heavens lamb of god who takes away the sins of the world send us the divine consoler Lamb of God, who take us away the sins of the world, fill us with the gifts of thy Spirit. Lamb of God, who take us away the sins of the world, make the fruits of the Holy Spirit increase within us. Come, O Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of thy faithful, and enkindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit, and they shall be created, and thou shalt renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. God, who by the light of the Holy Spirit instructed the hearts of the faithful, Grant us by the same Spirit to be truly wise and ever to rejoice in his consolation. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Act of Consecration to the Holy Spirit On my knees before the great multitude of heaven, heavenly witness, I offer myself, soul and body, to you, O eternal Spirit of God. I adore the brightness of your purity, the unerring keenness of your justice, and the might of your love. You are the strength and light of my soul. In you I live and move and am. I desire never to grieve you by unfaithfulness to grace, and I pray with all my heart to be kept from the smallest sin against you. Mercifully guard my every thought, and grant that I may always watch for your light and listen to your voice, and follow thy gracious inspirations. I cling to you and give myself to you, and ask you by your compassion to watch over me in your weakness, holding the pierced feet of Jesus and looking at his five wounds and trusting in his precious blood. 
and adoring his open side and stricken heart. I implore you, adorable spirit, helper of my infirmity, so to keep me in thy grace that I may never sin against you. Give me grace, O Holy Spirit, Spirit of the Father and of the Son, to say to you always and everywhere, Speak, Lord, for your servant is listening. Prayer for the seven gifts of the Holy Spirit. O Lord Jesus Christ, who before ascending into heaven did promise to send the Holy Spirit to finish your work in the souls of your apostles and disciples, deign to grant the same Holy Spirit to me, that he may perfect in my soul the work of your grace and your love. Grant me the spirit of wisdom, that I may despise the perishable things of the world and aspire only after the things that are eternal. The spirit of understanding, to enlighten my mind with the light of your divine truth. The spirit of counsel, that I may choose the surest way of pleasing God. And gaining heaven, the spirit of fortitude, that I may bear my cross with you and that I may overcome with courage all the obstacles that oppose my salvation. The spirit of knowledge that I may know God and know myself and grow perfect in the science of the saints. The spirit of piety that I may find the service of God sweet and amiable. The spirit of fear of the Lord that I may be filled with a loving reverence towards God and may dread in any way to displease him. Mark me, dear Lord, with the sign of your true disciples and animate me in all things with your spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless you all.